Thanks, Remy. Canada adds three more medals to its tally after day six of the 2018 Olympic Games. Tad Yan Bloman brings home the gold for speed skating by setting a new Olympic record. Canada won its second luge medal to date with a silver in the team relay event. While Megan Duhamel and Eric Radford brought home a bronze in pairs figure skating. Day six brings Canada's total medal count to 13 with four gold, five silver, and four bronze. Ted Jan Bloman sets a new record in the men's 10,000 meter speed skating event, winning the gold with a time of 12 minutes and 13.77 seconds. He beat out the record just minutes earlier by Dutch rival Sven Kramer. Bloman previously won the silver at uh, won silver at the 5,000 meter distance earlier during the games. Olympic dreams do come true for Megan Duhamel and Eric Radford. The pair took home bronze in pairs figure skating with a combined score of 230.15. Duhamel later took to Twitter to celebrate the victory by captioning, my life feels complete. A congratulations is due for, the, for Canada's luge team as they brought home Canada's second luge medal in the team relay event bringing home silver behind Germany's gold win while beating out the Austrian team. The winning sledders were Justin Snyth, Tristan Elker, Alex Goff, and Sam Edney. Goff brought home a bronze medal last Tuesday in the women's luge event as well. Canada's men's curling team is undefeated. They are 3-0 in the round-robin portion of the tournament, with victories over Italy, Great Britain, and Norway. The game against Norway was close, though. Uh, through seven ends until Kevin Coe stole a few in the eighth and ninth. Norway's late mistake on a takeout attempt could cause them the game. Canada will face North South Korea, still in the round robin session, and will push for a four straight win. The Canadian women's hockey team have completed a perfect preliminary, preliminary round. The women defeated the United States 2 to 1 Wednesday. The U.S. outshot the Canadians 45 to 23 but couldn't find the back of the net. Canada's two goals came in the second period from Megan Acosta on the power play and Sarah Nurse seven minutes later. Canada is now in first place in Group A and will play Sunday in the semifinals. Uh, the Canadian men's team also defeated Switzerland 5-1. Strong winds caused a delay for women's slalom event last Monday, resulting in a third delay for the event this week. The three Canadian athletes are rescheduled to compete, to compete tomorrow. Strong winds were also responsible for the rescheduled men's skiing Super G event as well. Originally scheduled for today, the event is pushed back until tomorrow. Strong winds also responsible for injuries with Olympic staff and fans. So far, 16 minor injuries were reported. Thanks, Remy. Back to you.